Hello ladies and gentlemen and a very warm welcome to you. My name is Alex of Small Cars Direct and I'm here to present this rather funky looking 2011 11 registered Mini Cooper Diesel. Finished in the Midnight Metallic as you can clearly see. It's covered 97,583 miles from noon. It's my job as Alex of Small Cars Direct to present this car to you in a full and transparent way highlighting all of its features its benefits running you through its condition so you guys have a full view so you can make decisions to whether you wish to come and buy this car reserve it or even have it delivered to your place of home or work because we do offer a nationwide delivery service so iconic design obviously it's mini cooper it's a fantastic blend of uh, funky looks as well as practicality as well. So um, does sit really well on these 17 inch bullet spoke alloy wheels, which are shod in tires that have more than ample amounts of tread remaining. If I just get you a close up, you can see how much tread's left there, loads of tread there left on there. And then looking at the front end, you can see clearly that it's got the chrome exterior pack. It's also got the white bonnet stripes. So nice contrast. Same for the roof. It's got the white roof and the white mirrors there as well. The front end then, looking uh, nice and clean. No major signs of stone chips, just the odd stone chip, but nothing horrendous. And uh, looking at this side, you see you've got fog lights fitted. It's got the headlights there, there looking nice and clear on both sides and this car does have a good level of service history as well looking in at all the wheels then just to give you full sight of the wheels condition falcon branded matching tires on the front then it's always nice to see and uh if we take a close look at the screen and notice that there's no chips or large cracks or anything like that untoward to the screen at all that's looking nice and clear then i'll show you the uh, passenger side as well just give you full view it's looking good same story for the roof that's looking nice No blemishes to the roof. I think the aerial is probably seen better days, but certainly picks up reception really well. So um, it's not fully operational. Badging's looking nice and clear on the rear. Chrome effect boot handles looking nice and fresh in appearance. The lights, they're looking nice and clear on the rear here as well. Chrome effect exhaust finisher. It's looking fresh in appearance. Nice to see that looking so shiny and the central rear fog lights looking good as well this near side rear light cluster is looking good and we just come on zoom in on the uh, rear wheels then you'll notice that there's uh, hardly any markings to know to the rear wheels the wheels are looking good throughout if we just take a closer look at this tire that looks virtually brand new hardly any uh, wear to that tire so that's fantastic to see and uh, same story here that looks like it's fairly recent tire as well if you want to scan down the side for dents i think uh we're going to be hard pushed to find any some scratches here to pick out which uh appear to have been touched in but i think check out the um check out the uh a hundred images and you can cross-reference what you're seeing here with the images to see see those because other than that I mean other than that there's nothing obviously other than just re the pure reflections that you get off the paintwork because it's so shiny there's no other noticeable scratches to report Got a couple really shallow car park dinks which 
be honest, I hadn't even seen until now. Got another one, a really small one just in there. So you've got those, what, three small car park dinks. And the marks. There. But that's... That's it. That's literally it. On this, what, 12... 12 years of age car. This wheel, I think we've already taken a zoomed in view on all of them apart from this one. There you go. This boot... Yes, that boot handle doesn't actually operate. You need the key, I think. So if we... I'll show you this. You press and hold this. It just pops the boot open, but I don't think you can actually open on the handle. So it's literally just on the key. So press and hold that button. If you have a look inside the boot, you'll notice it's looking nice and fresh in here. It's actually a fairly deep boot, considering the size of the car is quite small. If we have a look underneath here, you'll notice you've got your jack, a towing eye, wheel brace, and as well as a tyre sealant and compressor kit. And there's a locking wheel nut in the front uh, glove box as well. This car has a really high level of specification. So inside you'll notice it's got DAB radio. It's also got satellite navigation. Three spoke leather multifunction steering wheel with cruise control. Feature on the right hand side. It's got BC trip computer basically on the end of that stalk. That's what that means. And uh, got a six speed manual gearbox. Some weird that gear knob. Uh, mini navigation, DAB radio, Bluetooth as well. Your locking wheel nut is in there with a little tool to get the caps off the wheel nuts. And um, also got USB and auxiliary inputs down here as well. And this here is looking nice and clean. If you just check out the seats. You've also got a centrally mounted uh, armrest as well. Now they didn't all have that as an option. You've also got the um, side airbags as well as you can see on the side here. So it's a nice safe place to be in here. Got isofix points in the rear as well. Let's check out the engine bay for you then. Show you the beating heart of the uh, Mini. It's 1.6 litre turbo diesel engine, producing 110 brake horsepower. Road tax fee is absolutely nothing, and it's capable of uh, anything up to 80 miles per gallon on the extra urban cycle. 80. So uh, these cars are known for their go kart like handling, and uh, thanks to being engineered in part with BMW certainly benefiting from some BMW derived components this car is extremely well built so you've got the benefit of the um, reliability the solid feel but you also get the individual benefits of the um, snazzy uh, appearance as well as the go-kart like handling and super low running costs so really there's not much not to like about this particular mini Cooper diesel it's been serviced at 29,000, 41, 53, 58, 64, 70, 75, and most recently, just 2,000 miles ago, at 95,201 miles. You can reserve this car from as little as £100, and finance is available with rates starting from as little as 11.9% APR, depending on which lender you opt for. And... Um, we do offer a nationwide delivery service and you can part exchange this car you can part exchange your current car with us here at small cars direct we have over 300 reviews for the business online um, price check our cars regularly to make sure they're competitive so we do not accept offers and payment is via cash or bank transfer little cubby hole down there further couple cubby holes down here there's the navigation screen working Let's do a quick check on the uh, vehicle via the central display unit. So a quick check of that. Check out the DB radio as well. Vehicle status. Everything okay, which is good to see. Let's just check out the radio.
There's your normal radio there. Music working, which is good. Let's just go back, check out DAB. Let's check out that. 